What is going on beautiful people and welcome back to the coolest, most amazing, incredible channel on all of YouTube. If you are here watching this video, right away it tells me that you are invested into becoming all you can be. You are putting in the work today for a better tomorrow and I just want to let you know how much I respect that. It seems like in today's day and age we live in a society where people are just settling for average at best. Nobody wants to go out and do anything amazing and we're just sitting there living mundane, boring lives when we're capable of doing amazing things, man. We are capable of doing incredible things, but people seem to just get stuck in comfort zones, they fall victim to shitty habits, and then they never truly end up tapping into their potential. And that is sad. And I understand that things happen, but we are in total control of our lives. And I just want to share with you guys some things that you can do right now to totally unfuck your life. Now, I don't claim to have all of the answers. I've been on a personal development journey now for 10 years. If you want to know my story, I shared it in another video. But what my intention is, is to share everything that I have learned along the way in hopes to encourage you to shake it up in your own life, man. To get clear on who you are as a person and what it is you want out of this experience of life and to go after it. I'm doing that in my own life, I'm leading by example and I just want to encourage you to do the exact same thing. Everything on this channel is 100% free, I'm going to share everything that I know, everything that I do with my clients with y'all, but I do want to just have one gentleman's agreement where if you're going to watch this video, you subscribe for me. It takes no work, it'll help me out massively and I will greatly appreciate it. So subscribe to the channel, damn it, and let's get into the video. Your default setting is absolutely amazing. You are capable of doing incredible things. And sometimes along the way, when everybody that we're surrounded by is living a mediocre average, hopefully even at best, lifestyle, it can be hard to look around and try and find greatness. It can be hard to step out of your comfort zone and do something amazing when everybody else is stuck in their way. So that's why it is important to find yourself a community of people who are moving forward together, who are all investing today for a better tomorrow. You know, so find your tribe, hang out with those people, surround yourself of like mind. It is extremely important. But I want to share something factual with you right here, right now. 40 to 90% of our lives are run on automatic behaviors and habits. And the truth of the matter is, is if those habits are not serving your best interest, then they're going to end up running your life. First you create your habits and then they create you. Habits can be ways of thinking, habits can be victimizing yourself, making excuses, drinking on the weekends to numb the pain and never really take a good look at what's happening inside. Habits come in many different ways. They can be behavioral, they can be like abusive, destructive, whatever the case may be. But there, a habit is something that you have done so many times, you practice the behavior so many times that it becomes automatic and you can do it without even thinking about it. That's what a habit is. So, if we're looking at this, and this is what I've been doing in my personal life that has helped me out tremendously. What I did is this new year, I sat back and I said, okay, where is it that I'm looking to go? So, identify your where. I want to have my, I'm going to have, I'm going to have my retreat center here in Cabo. I'm going to buy a couple of acres right on the beach and I'm going to build a massive compound where I can bring people from all over the world to come and heal, to come and exercise, to come and eat organic food, to come and do plant medicine and release the trauma that they've been carrying around with them their entire lives. I want to show people what is possible when you make the investments into yourself. I'm going to have a global brand of people all working on becoming the best version of themselves. We are creating a movement of people that are investing today for a better tomorrow and living the best quality of life that they possibly can. That is my mission. Okay, so now I know what it is that I want. Now, who do I need to become in the process that's going to allow me to create this whole experience? Well, I know that I have these shitty habits that I need to let go of. I know that I'm sleeping in until 7 a.m. I should probably be up at 5 o'clock a.m. and put in a couple extra hours of work. I know that I'm watching YouTube at night before bed until 12 o'clock. I should probably cut that out. And I start taking a good look at my habits that I have in place that are stopping me from really living an optimized life. So I take a good look at the habits and I'm like, okay, I'm going to remove this. I'm going to remove that. And one of my biggest ones personally was I would wake up and I would go to the gym first thing in the morning, which was not good because I was investing all my creative energy, all of my optimal time of day into the gym. 
And I've been training for 15 years now. So for me, the gym is not a priority. Growing my business, sharing my message with the world is my priority. So I had to make that switch. And when I made that switch, I wanna just let you know, it is so uncomfortable as you guys decide what it is you want and then who you need to become in the process and you start changing out those habits and you start making adjustments, say you're stopping snacking at nighttime, maybe you're gonna stop smoking weed, maybe you're gonna stop drinking on the weekends. As you start to make those changes in your life, it is going to be the most uncomfortable experience ever. Transformation sucks, man. It is ugly, it is hard, you're going to war with yourself mentally, you're probably lashing out at people, you're frustrated, you're angry, but the only thing you need to know to keep it very simple is just stay on course, man. You know what you're doing, you know who you're looking to become in the process, and you know why it's important to you, which is gonna be number three, which I'll share with you in a second. But you know all of these things, so stay the course. Anytime discomfort is presented or resistance is presented and you feel like you're just gonna snap and break, good news, you're on the right track. Push through it, stay true, and just remind yourself that this is just an opportunity for you to grow. This resistance that you're encountering is just another opportunity for you to grow and for you to prove to yourself that you are in fact what you say you are and prove to yourself that you want the result that you're creating bad enough to go through the shit in order to get it. And when you do that, when you do that, I swear it's like affirming to the powers above that you do in fact want it bad enough to go through the shit and then beautiful things start to happen. That's where transformation is truly born is when you're going through all of these, tr like all of this trauma, all of these in like these uncomfortable, really, really hard mental warfare when you're going through that and you actually push through it. On the other side of that is this high, this vibration elevation of just complete bliss and proof that you are capable of achieving everything you've set out for. It is the most incredible feeling that you will ever experience on planet Earth. It is better than love, it is better than drugs, it is better than sex, it is better than anything. And that is self-love, truthfully loving yourself enough to go to war against your habits and your behaviors and your programs because you love yourself enough and you know you deserve more. That is the biggest gift that you could ever give yourself. And I swear the powers that be see that and they're proud of you. I don't know what it is, who it is, whatever, but I feel like energetically you raise yourself up so high that your vibration raises and then you see a little glimpse on the other side that my goals are totally achievable. I am actually capable of achieving this. And then you start to look around in your life at other areas that need improvement and you're like, I'm going after it, man. And then you start to build this character, the version 2.0 of you, and then you present him to the world or her to the world and you're like, this is how I show up now. This is what I'm about and this is how much I love myself. And when you do that, you inspire other people to do the same thing. Some people might look at you like, who the fuck is this guy? Who does he think he is? Oh, yo, what are you too good for us now? Oh, what do you think? You're so cool, what a blah, blah. All a bunch of bullshit, man. People get intimidated by your high vibration. When you're really vibing high and you're really crushing it and you're really doing your thing, people that are not on the same level as you or people who are insecure about who they are will be very intimidated by that. And that's good, let them be. And be a beacon of hope and possibility of what is truly possible for people when they invest in themselves. And when you do that, your kids, your family, your friends are gonna start to see what is possible and you're gonna encourage them to do the same thing, especially for your kids, man. Your kids never listen to what you're saying, they do what they see you doing. And when they see mom or dad waking up and exercising and eating healthy and feeling good about himself, drawing boundaries in the sand, being confident, walking with your head held high, speaking his mind, that is the kind of role model that they need. They're not just gonna listen to what you say when your actions say something totally different. So this is exactly how you do it, fam. You identify what it is you want. If I was sitting there stuck and I had to unfuck my life, I would first identify what I want, and then I would identify who I need to become in the process to achieve that, and then I would take a really good look at the habits that I have in place that are preventing me from achieving this next version of myself. And then I would slowly start to make adjustments in my daily routine on how I could eliminate those habits that will allow me to create this version 2.0 of myself that is gonna be the person that is going to get me to where I am looking to go. Because 
who you are right now is amazing, but if you're looking to get to a whole different place, you need to create the person who's gonna take you there. And as you go on this journey, just be aware that you're gonna be alone, there's gonna be people who doubt you, there's gonna be every single, as soon as you decide that this is something that you wanna do, be ready for the universe to throw every single thing that it possibly can at you, the bills piling up, your friends asking you to go out on the weekends, doing all, like everything that could possibly go wrong will. And it's gonna be a test to see how bad you want it. And I promise you on the other side of those tests when you pass is the feeling that I just went through. It is the most incredible feeling ever that you could possibly imagine. And I want for you to experience that. It is my purpose, it is my mission to help you realize that that is a possibility for you. In a world that is telling you, no, 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 go to work, be a slave to the system, eat the drive through food, drink the alcohol, watch the news. In a world that is totally fucking brainwashing you, I want to be the person that is here, leading by example, showing you what is possible. And when you start to vibrate on that frequency and you are connected to a higher source, incredible things start to happen. The right people come, the right opportunities come. And it's like, when people are like, oh, I wanna make more money, I wanna do all this shit. It's like, you don't need to look at how you can make more money. You need to become more valuable. That is the only fucking key that is missing in your life right now, is it's not anything you're chasing out here. If you want something out here, become it right here and then everything will work itself out. And how you become it right here is by being the best version of yourself. Waking up early, moving your body, drinking your water, getting your proper sleep, identifying the shitty habits that you have and replacing them and removing them from your life. It is that simple. Theoretically, it is that simple. When you're actually implementing it, it is a challenge. It took me seven years to figure out and since the new year, I have really been dialed in. I feel like my life has totally changed. The version 2.0 is created. I'm carrying myself differently. I'm not a victim to addictions or habits or any kind of shit, just totally focused and dialed in and it feels incredible, man, and I want for you to experience that too. So let's get to work. If you guys need any help or anything at any given time, follow me on Instagram. I'll put my handle in the description below. Follow me on Instagram, shoot me a message. We actually do, tw I'm doing right now a 21 day challenge to where people are doing exactly, I literally create them roadmaps, myself and my team. We have a team of nutritionists, personal trainers, hypnotherapists, yoga instructors, and we all come together and create plans for people to do exactly what I was just talking about in this video. So I just wanna say, man, I believe in you. There's a whole life out there worth living. Get out of your own way and go after it. See you on the next video.